doing breakfast. My mornings here start with a cup of hot coffee. The wonderful thing about coffee is it always turns on my mood, lifts my spirits and makes me a happy person. After breakfast, we went to a nearby Gothic-style Catholic church, San Giovanni Battista. It is a beautiful monument of medieval culture and architecture. Today, our main plan is to go inside San Mar Basilica. It's Sunday and Venice is brutally crowded with day trippers. Now we are in St. Mark Basilica Terrace. Inside the church, taking photos are not permittable. This is the bell tower of St. Mark Basilica. It is one of the most recognizable symbol of the city. The view from here is breathtaking. The beautiful Venetian architecture along with the view of the lagoon. This place is so amazing. Did you like here? Oh yeah, this is amazing. The weather is super hot. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> enjoying it, guys. Huh? We just went to St. Mark's Basilica. It's, it's a very nice place.
found a very nice and cozy restaurant and the food was very tasty. After a grand lunch, we are just roaming around the narrow alleys of Venice. We collected our luggages from the hotel and took a water taxi to go to the railway station as we are leaving Venice and going to our second destination, the eternal city Rome. Now we are going to the station from uh, the Venice uh, main island San Marco and uh, we are going to the Grand Canal and this is a very scenic ride as we can see. The Grand Canal is the main waterway of Venice. 3 km long and 225 feet wide Grand Canal has an average depth of 17 feet. The Grand Canal is lined on either side by churches, hotels and other public buildings in Roman, Gothic and Renaissance style. This is the famous Rialto Bridge. This is the true heart of Venice and the most popular tourist destination of Venice. had an unforgettable time in Venice and our friends were so happy that they started dancing in the water taxi.
We are in the train Italo and we are heading towards Rome and it will take two and a half hours from here. First we're going to Rome, then we're going to Zurich, then we're going to Paris and then we'll go to school and then we'll then we'll go to But this is our first experience in uh, train Eurorail, right? Yeah. Eurorail. Eurorail. Yeah. It's, it's called Italo, right? Yeah.